Hello everyone, I'm going to show you how to clone your voice or other voices for free so you can install in your computer because uh, at the moment if you search in Google this tool you will see there are many services but most of them charge you a price, a cost so it's not free so um, what I will show you is that you can do for yourself, install on your computer and, and do the job, which is clone your voice or use other voices. So I will get straight to the point. Let's get started. First, you need to go to this project in GitHub. You can see this Manju RPC. You will see all details on here. And um, first go to this, this option releases. So let's go on here. And um, there's two options without train, without train, training or with train. In this case, I will use this one because I, I will demonstrate that you can uh, clone your voice using this method, train. So let's get started. Download. Once it's done, you can see here the file. Just execute it. And um, this file will, will make all the installation. You can see here how it's installing. So probably it will take some minutes. So you can see the time remaining. So let's wait. Okay, after some minutes, it will download this file. So basically I think it's, it's the repository. Uh, when it's done, what you can do is just uncompress this. Okay, once done, go to the folder, uncompressed folder, then execute. We're gonna put this by type. This one, go web dot bat. So just execute it and you will see this console. Um, It will appear this access for the firewall, just a low access. Then the application will be loaded in the browser, as you can see here. So here it is, the uploaded. So um, let's test. In the first option, we can clone the voice. And we need the voice model on here. And we will download it from other sources like voice model. You can see many voice models on here. Also on Discord, you can find it in AI Hub community. You can see many voice models. For example, this one, you can, you have here the file, also the, the preview. Can you tell me how can Mondays? There it is for our tests. I will use this site, voicemodel.com. Um, I will use a popular voice model, which is from Mr. Beast. I will download the file. There it is. It's downloading. Okay, it's done. I will uncompress it. Then we have two files, index file and PTH file. I will move the PTH file 
go to the project under weights folder then go to the index file move this one to logs and create a folder mr beast there it is now go to the application refresh voice list and you can see here the model is loaded also the index file is automatically selected and for our test i will we need a another audio to to test this model for example i will use a, an audio file that comes by default this one the other options i will leave it as comes uh, by default and just convert it there it is let's play it this is a sample audio for you do you like the voice model good so you can see it's working fine now i will use my own audio file i will just copy on audio files here this is my audio file let's hear it hello welcome to my channel if you like my video don't forget to give me a like and hit the subscribe button okay this is my audio file i will just refresh the voice list the model is loaded fine then on the audio files i can i can choose it this one then i will press the convert button there it is let's play it hello welcome to my channel if you like my video don't forget to give me a like and hit the subscribe button you can see it's working fine and uh it's it's fine the option here is working fine so you have it okay the, the next option is this one vocals and companion separation so this will uh, extract the vocal from your audio file or music file and for our test i will use this this okay so i will copy the youtube link go to there are many services that convert youtube to mp3 so i will just pay, paste the url and it will convert There I have the audio file on here, the mp3. Then on the app, I will, you can select the, the folder or you can drag and drop. In this case, I will drag and drop. You can see here. And I will leave this one as blank. Then I will select the model. I will select this one and i think i will select mp3 then convert you will see it's working underground okay let's wait some minutes and it's done you can see success on here go to file then i think it's opt and you can see the result if we check here on the vocal let's hear it i need you feeling like you want me and i guess in a way you do all my breath on reveling emotions 
Well, it's impressive. It's working. You can see the vocal has been extracted. Also, the instrumental. Impressive. So you can see it's working fine. This option, uh, the vocal extraction is working quite fine. Okay, so the next option is training. So this is important because with here you can create your own voice model. And um, so then you can use it on, on this first option. So let's do it. First, put a name. In this case, my voice version one. I will use version two. You can play with this, with it. Also, I think I need a data set, which is the the audio that will need to train with to extract the the voice model. In the in this case, I will use just the voice that I use it thing on here. This voice. And what is audio data set? Here it is. Okay. And now going to, I think we can process data. Once it says end pro process, it's finished on here. Then um, just feature extraction. You can see it's working background. All features done. It's finished on here. And then we can um, set up on here the the safe safe frequency total training epochs uh, if you increase this one it will be better it will be the the quality will be better if you increase this number but for this case i will use just 20 and i think that's it i will just train feature index then train model you can see you can see in the background is is it's working processing so let's wait some minutes okay it's finished you can see it's finished also here saving final success here the train log Okay, now just you can see the new voice model on here. And you can see the epochs, uh, five epochs, 10 epochs. In this case, we can remove this, these ones. And also we can see the index file is generated as well so if we go to here just ref refresh voice model i will choose my voice you can see here the index file is is loaded as well i will choose um, this audio file that comes by default from this project once audio is generated, we can... This is a sample audio for you. Do you like the voice model? You can see it's 
it's like it's working but but i think it needs more training probably uh in this case i i, I use uh, an audio file with like five seconds and um, and for example i made another training with with more minutes with my voice okay i think all the options are fine we'll use the audio file that comes by default in the project and let's do it this is a sample audio for you do you like the voice model i think this is quite better so this is uh, better really better so it works it works with we if you train with uh, your voice model with um, more minutes like uh, three minutes something like that even better if it's like uh, more than that but you can see it, it's working fine okay also you can do which batch conversion as i explained it before so it's working fine the training also on here this option is for merging so you can, if you want to merge one voice model to another voice model you will do it on here and i think that's it hope it helps you to to clone your voice just let me know